everybody, and guten tag, Freunde! It is I, the Teutonic Plague, welcoming you to my little corner of YouTube that I like to call my channel. <laughs> Woo! Now, this video is for those of you who are unaware of what I am and who I am and what I do and what this channel is. This is my introductory video, all right? Because I got more to say than can be said on an introductory in an introductory comment, and if people start commenting on my discussion page, the introductory comment's going to be buried under all this stuff. Anyway, so I'm just going to make this introductory video instead because it's more convenient. You know what I mean? <laughs> anyway, let's get right to it, shall we? First subject matter is who is this guy? You know, who just came out of the goddamn woodwork and started making a fucking video. And let me tell you this about that. For all you know and for all you care, I'm Teutonic Plague. I'm American. I'm going to college. I'm studying to be a medical laboratory scientist. And I have a girlfriend. So slam bam, thank you man for subject matters done. Secondly, as a college student who happens to live on campus, I happen to live on campus, and as such, I got roommates. So if you guys hear noise in the other room or hear somebody knocking on my door, you know who it is. And if there's somebody knocking on my door, then you know my you know my roommates they'll you know if they're in trouble, it seems like they always go to old plague over here because apparently I'm Mister Dependable. Jesus Christ. Anyway, so that's that. Uh, next subject matter is what am I going to do, all right? Now, folks, I'm an LPer, and for those of you who are unaware as to what, uh, you know, of what an LPer is, it's a Let's Player, and a Let's Player is someone who gets a piece of recording software, like the one I have here, and uh, records themselves playing a video game and talking over it, offering commentary on the game, on the people who made the game, or as in most cases, you know, engaging in idle banter. And they upload it to YouTube, and everybody has a little fun, you know, real funny. <laughs> you know, the views and the subs roll in, hopefully, and this, that, and the other. So, that's what I'm going to be doing. Now, you might be wondering, Oh, Jay Plank, you're a Let's Player. What kind of video game do you have? <laughs> all right, all right, calm down. I'll tell ya, calm down. For your viewing pleasure, I happen to have several video games. I got uh, Medieval 2 Total War, and I do happen to have the Kingdoms expansion for that. I got, uh, which uh, basically gives me four more games. The Teutonic Campaign, the Britannia Campaign, the Americas Campaign, and the Crusade Campaign. So that's five, effectively. And I also have Napoleon, I also have Empire Total War, I've also got Napoleon Total War, I've got uh, Mountain Blade Warband, I got Warcraft 3, I got Warcraft 3, The Frozen Throne, and, last, uh, and lastly I got Dragon Age Origins and Dragon Age Inquisition. Now folks, I would have Dragon Age 2, but something fucked up with the game and I had to uninstall it, and I have to repurchase it and reinstall it. I can't just reinstall it. I gotta pay fifteen more dollars because oh, my registration code is invalid because I already used it. Oh, you have to give us money if you want to reinstall the. God damn it! Give me that goddamn drink. Give me my drink. Ah. Uh... God, I love that sound. This, my friends, is Mountain Dew Voltage. It's like Jesus in soda form. It's blue raspberry Mountain Dew. It tastes fantastic. And uh, notice I said it's Mountain Dew. All right? Ain't white lightning. It ain't Mountain Lightning. Ain't that cheap shit either. It's Mountain Dew. Voltage. Besides, Mountain Lightning only comes in one flavor. How fucking boring is that? Mountain Dew Voltage. Buy it, folks! <laughs> anyway, 
today. I just had to get a little off kilter there. But I've been neglecting my drink! Anyway. I plan to buy Dragon Age 2 again soon. I don't know how soon, but hopefully soon. And, uh... <clears throat> In regards to this girlfriend I said I had, I uh, actually, I'm going to be dropping off of YouTube for two weeks, come December. I'm going to, I'm going to remind you of this. I said it once, and I'm going to say it again, probably several times, so you guys know. But I'm going to be, I'm going to be uh, gone two weeks in December, so that I can visit my girlfriend. It's a long distance relationship we got going. We're both in the United States. So hey, but it's it's long distance, and I'm gonna visit her in December. So um, at least I have that to look forward to, and that is uh, that for that. So next subject matter is yes, I do swear in my videos. All right. <clears throat> Now, my attitude towards that is, you know, anyone who can't let out a fuck or a shit on occasion when they're, you know, at least when they're not in polite society, of course, when they're not in polite company. But anyone who can't swear while they're not in polite company, I don't particularly agree with their philosophy. Now, now I hate to be doing this crap. I hate to be doing this. I really do. But... You know, I gotta quote Donald Trump here and say that political correctness isn't my problem, it's America's problem. I mean, I'm sorry. I mean, I, I know you can't believe that I quoted Donald Trump, but still. Of course, I'd rather have Carson than Trump. Hell, if he's not on the ballot, then Sanders. Anyway. But this isn't a goddamn political discussion. This is, a, this, this is an introductory video, so let's get just right to that, all right? Now, yeah, I don't believe in political correctness. It's the fear of adjectives and labels. But here's the thing. I guess what I'm trying to say is, yeah, I swear in my videos. I speak a little uh, <coughs> French, if you know what I mean. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so that's that. And, um, you know, you might be asking yourself, Oh, well, what are you going to do for your first Let's Play play? Come on, tell us what you're going to do first. <laughs> Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. What I'm going to be doing for my first Let's Play, you nonsensical sack of nonsense, is I'm going to do... I'm going to play us some Medieval 2 Total War, all right? And I'm going to be the Holy Roman Empire, and here's why. Here is why, all right? I'm part German. This is why I'm calling myself the Teutonic Plague, and the fucking words are in German script, and this, that, and the other. I'm part German, and I'm embracing my German heritage, aside from the Nazis. All right, the Nazis, those evil bastards, they can eat my dick up till they heck up. They suck... They suck the gold plating off of the state coach of England, all right? They suck the gold off of the state coat off of the royal coach of England. So that, you know, fuck the Nazis. But 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 Frederick the Great, all right, Frederick the Great, Otto von Bismarck, Imperial Germany, uh, Prussia, Teutonic Order, Holy Roman Empire, you guys are cool. All right, Charlemagne, you you guys are cool. That's why my background is black and yellow, because it's the uh, colors of the Holy Roman Empire, for which the Teutonic Order, which was founded in 1190, actually fought. They fought for the Holy Roman Empire, and at Poland's request, they fought Lithuania. They fought the pagan Lithuanians. It was their job to Christianize the uh, area along the Baltic coast, and they fought Lithuania. And... Um, Correct me if I'm wrong, all you history buffs can correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe they actually ended up fighting Poland. They actually had to fight Poland. The Teutonic Order is still active today. It's based in Vienna. I think they have chapters throughout Europe, if not the world, but they're based in Vienna and Austria. And I don't think they're a militaristic order anymore. I don't think they're a military order anymore, but... Then again, you got to take into account the fact that the Catholic Church has more secrets than one can shake their dicks at. So, 
Yeah. Next, what what program do I use to record my shit, all right? I use Bandicam, folks, all right? And the reason I use Bandicam is, you know, Bandicam is going to be a little better than Fraps because with Fraps, with the free version, you only get 30 seconds of free recording time per session, and you have to pay $60 if you want to buy it. But if you have Bandicam, you only have to pay $40 to purchase the thing. And if you're running the free version, you get 10 minutes of free recording time per session. Now, both of the free versions, you got to contend with a water. You got you got to work your way around a watermark. There's going to be a watermark across the top of the screen, and there's no watermark going across the top of my goddamn screen. And we're over 10 minutes, so this is proof that my bandy cam has been bought and paid for. And another reason you want, you know, it's the pricing. If you buy Bandicam instead of Fraps, for all you uh, would-be Let's Players out there, for all you would-be LPers who want to be more like, you know, the great Markiplier, uh, 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 Tetra Ninja, those guys, you want Bandicam. Bandicam's your answer. Because if you buy Bandicam as opposed to Fraps, you will be $20 up on your goddamn money! <laughs> Woo! And who doesn't want extra cash for fuck's sake? Alright? Good lord! I mean, for fucking outside, it's a no brainer. Let me, let, me, let me take a chug of my drink. My throat's a little dry. Let me give me my drink. I've been neglecting my drink. Man shouldn't do that. And the only reason I drink soda instead of beer is because, well, the dorm I live in, it's a dry dorm. They don't let you bring alcohol into your dorm room in this dormitory, all right, at all. Now, there's a certain dormitory on campus that does, but, you know, and of course, in order to drink, you've got to be 21 or over to participate in that sort of activity, and I am. I am. So, you know, I'm, I'm legal. So, I can drink. I just can't drink in my dorm, that's all. But I can drink soda, that's cool. So that's what I do. That's what I do, for Christ's sake! Ha <laughs> ha! Ah, Jesus Christ. Anyway. But we do have a pretty good... We, we do have a pretty damn good bar in town that I like to go to every once in a while. You can find me there every once in a while when I have the, when I have the money to get a damn drink. When I have the money to get a drink, it, 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 it's, you know, my drink of choice, fuzzy navel, all right? All right, orange juice, peach schnapps, gold, man, fucking gold. Or I'll drink a Mike's Black Cherry or something to that effect. And, and, they're, and they're a microbrewery, they make their own beer, so, I'll, so you'll catch me drinking some of that. They're going to be doing an Oktoberfest thing this year, I think, so I'm going to be I'm gonna do. I'm gonna be participating in that. I'm gonna be conducting myself in that manner. Go to Oktoberfest, conduct myself in that fashion. <laughs> so, you know, probably I'm not gonna make a video that day because I don't want to make you know sound like a drunken fool and make an ass of myself. But in regards to how often I'm gonna make a video, I'm gonna uh, expect a new video to drop uh, at least one. You know probably once a week. Expect a new video to drop once a week. But, you know, once a week. And I'm going to try to shit out my videos on Fridays. And if I can't do that, then sometime during the weekend. Because let me tell you something. I'm a student, and us students, we have to do things. We got responsibilities. We got deadlines. We got assignments. All right, we got tests to study for, for Christ's sake. I just took a couple of goddamn exams today. Now, granted, they were pretty easy tests. I'm absolutely certain that I passed both of them with flying colors. But anyway, so expect a new video to come out once a week. 
once a week if I can. But, um, guys, I think I'm going to kill it here, all right? That was my introductory for uh, video for you, all right? So to recap my first Let's Play, it's going to be Medieval 2 Total War. I'm going to be the Holy Roman Empire. And you can expect that sometime either this Friday or this weekend, uh, along with my introductory video. So um, you guys have fun. I'll see you in my first installment of, of uh, Medieval 2 Total War. It's the Holy Roman Empire that I'm going to be being. And that's that for that. So, Alvida Zane and stay Teutonic, folks!